Look, 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 look. Look, 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 look at this. Somebody come look at this. Look at this. Somebody come and look at this. Look at this. What is up, y'all? What is up? Hell yeah. So, I'm out here in the garage. This is what I've been dealing with, dude. This weather, you know, so... We haven't been able to get uh, anything off. We got a couple races off uh, the other night. Um, just kind of getting back into, you know... Some of you are gonna probably hate me for this. So, I've got the G8. If you're new to the channel, uh, it's a 2009 uh, stock trans, stock bottom in. Uh, LSA, um, SPS cylinder heads, and uh, stage three boost cam, Brian Tooley. And obviously we've added the catch can, some other things. Um, obviously the box over here, if some of you are looking at that, that's to cool the blower. Um, just some, some stuff that was actually on it, you know, for a while now. So um, I really like this car. Um, I know I said that I want to turbo it. We're still kind of waiting to see what we're going to do with that. Um, I took the Honda out this weekend, which is right here. Um, if you guys have been on my channel quite a bit, um, or I guess from the beginning, I should say, you remember my green one. Well, my green one was a full interior. There was nothing done to it. Started out uh, just B20 NA. Um, and then we turboed the car. We had like a, a huge turbo on it. Well, not a huge turbo, but a, a decently sized turbo on it for a while. Um, then we went to a 3076 and then we went to a, uh, 35, I don't know, like a 3582 or something. I could be wrong, but that's what's on it now. Um, we got it in the new shell. So this is not the old car. Um, my old car actually went to my buddy, buddy Brian. Um, he's got it now. Looks super clean still. Uh, but I ended up picking up this car and the reason I did it was because it's got a cage in it It's got the Kirky um, Had the right cluster and everything Can't probably see in there, but mine didn't have a tack or nothing this uh, car So this car's actually got my other car had drums on it um, This car is actually rear disc uh, it's got the wheel studs. We have, kind of see it back there. We got the battery in the back. Um, we got the cutoff switch. You know, obviously we can charge it right here. Um, but yeah, it's uh, basically I made the swap because I really wanted to get this car to where I could get it on the track. So, that's why I did it. And that's why I think you guys are gonna get mad at me because I took it out uh, last weekend, had a little fun with it. And uh, the way it's right now, it's making 10 pounds. Like it rips pretty good. You know, if you know Hondas, they, you know, they do pretty well. They're lightweight. Um, this is a stock bottom end. Um, and then it's just GR, GSR cams, GSR trans. And then it's got a wore out ACT in it. And this weekend was probably one of the first weekends I got to take the car out and kind of mess around, mess around with some people with it. And I ran into a few people where I really wanted to beat them and I knew I could, but I couldn't hit the damn gears in the damn thing. So this week I went down to my boys at Atomic Raceworks. We have a stage five, uh, comp clutch coming in it should be here tomorrow so we're gonna put that clutch in this car 
And then once I get it in there, we're going to put the boost by gear in it. And then we're going to turn it up. And these guys that I was playing around with, we're going to go back out there and we're going to play with them. One in particular, <laughs> I had my son with me and we we're kind of, you know, driving around. He wanted to drive with me. So, you know, I let him. But we roll up next to this guy. It's like a burgundy Mustang. He looks over at me, kind of a bigger guy tattooed, gives me the stupidest look he probably could have gave me. And when we took off, you know, I banged out, like I knew he was gonna take off, so he takes off. So I bang first, I bang second, you know, and I went to bang third and go around him and uh, I couldn't hit the damn gear. Really pissed me off just cause of the look this guy gave me. So we're gonna put this thing back together and we're gonna go hunting for this guy. And I'm gonna give him the stupidest look ever and then I'm gonna wave to his ass when we bust his ass with the Civic. So, like I said, if you're not a fan of the Civic, it might make you a little mad because we're not gonna go bang on him in the G8. This car makes 630, 625 to 630 of the wheels. It, it would be all right. He probably wouldn't have gave me the same look if I rolled up in this thing, but uh, who knows? Maybe we'll uh, go gap his ass in that one and we'll come back in this one and we'll really put the gap on him. But, you know, I just know that I'm gonna go in the direction that I'm going in. Um, with my channel, dude, I try to put everything on here. So we have had some street racing. Um, obviously, I have my cars. I haven't done anything to them lately. This car needs a converter, you know. I'm still in the process and figuring out what the hell I'm going to do with it. I go back and forth more than anybody. So if you've been watching my channel, you probably know that. But in the meantime, I'm going to get the clutch for this car. We're going to get it in. We're going to clean up all this wiring BS. I'm going to start doing a bunch of stuff to this thing. Um, I do want to get it looking better. And then, uh, yeah, we're going to go bust that guy's ass. So just a little update for you guys. Um, I just like having fun. So my channel is not really geared towards one thing or another, you know, and I appreciate it if you've subscribed and uh, we're going to try to get all those things that have been on my channel. It's still going to be a part of the channel, but um, I'm going to focus on the Civic for a little bit and uh, <laughs> don't unsubscribe because of that. And I hope that uh, we gain some more subscribers, you know, in the process. But uh, I'm going to take this car out and almost surprise some people with it, you know. We're gonna get those stupid looks and then we're just gonna leave them in the rear view. So that's my plan. Um, kind of progressing the Civic a little bit more like I intended to. You know, I wanna get the car in the tens, um, you know, and just go have fun with it. I had my wife driving the G8 last weekend, you know, and it's a blast for me to see that. A blast for my, my wife and my daughter to be in this car. And, you know, my son and I would be in the Honda just kind of cruising around. But uh, I do wanna make the Honda a little more serious. So. That's what we're going to do. And we're going to push the limits of this stock motor. And if it doesn't last, then we're going to do a Benson sleeve block in it. And uh, we're going to get it making right around 550, 600. I'm thinking right around, I don't know, let's say 450 to 550, you know, in that range. It's probably going to be more like 500, but that's where I want to be at. So, hell yeah, just a little update for you guys. And, uh, we're going to start doing it, man. I'm going to start doing some things, and we'll get some racing. Like I said, um, the weather's been crap, but uh, if you follow my channel, hopefully you're following, and, you know, hopefully you like the cars that are on the channel and, and some of the content that I bring. If you got suggestions, let me know. Some of y'all don't like talking, but, hey, I like talking. So <laughs> trying to connect with you guys, you know, and can't just put a bunch of videos up. So... You know, I want to thank you all for subscribing. Um, obviously, I think we were at like 5, 425 maybe last time I looked, you know. But, uh, yeah, I'm really going to start doing some things with these cars and um, can only do so much, obviously, with COVID and everything. But uh, I'm going to manage, you know, during these times. It's a lot easier for me to spend, spend money on the Honda. You know, let's be honest. You know, this car is going to take probably another 10 grand to get it where I want it. You know, if we go turbo or even if we keep the LSA and we pulley it and, and do the things we want to do, we're still going to have to build the bottom end. We're still going to have to build the tranny. We have to put a converter in it. You know, we're going to have to upgrade the fuel system, injectors, pumps, 
you know, so it's going to be a lot of money. So for me right now, in the time that we're in, uh, the Honda makes more sense for me to kind of mess with. And uh, I do have a lot of fun in it as well. I'm not one-sided or the other. I'm not a four-cylinder guy or just a VA guy, you know. So hopefully uh, bring some content you guys like and, uh, you know, it is what it is. So thank you for subscribing. I'm going to throw some clips in here. And uh, we got a couple races, like I said. I messed around with the drone, pulled it out. Dude, I'm terrible with it. I haven't flown that thing in like a year, so forgive me a little bit but we're gonna get some more of those and uh yeah we're gonna get some more racing on the channel but uh i'm gonna get this honda going and we're gonna go bust that guy's ass so thanks for subscribing and uh i will catch you guys in the next one definitely let me know what you want to see and uh like i said we're gonna be working on the honda quite a bit so don't hate me for it peace out y'all so what is this five three five three uh, uh, 2003 avalanche just stop. It's got a cam and long tubes, cold air intake, tran tran tranny stock. Nice. Yeah. Does and it make for can, power? It still has all the dirt from the junker. Pro probably <laughs> 330. 330? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, is that a, what, what is it? It's a 5.3. It's a 5.3. Yeah. 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 Those headers are 5.0 BBK long tubes. Oh, really? You see him on centers, you just cut oh. them off, all the off, and weld them on. It's only an LS1 intake, too, not an LS6 intake. Yeah. What's all down to this one? Uh, just uh, drop an air filter, down pipe, and the tube. Nice. Aftermarket charge pipe. What's it make for power? Uh, about 400 with the wheel. 400? I don't know. I don't know. I'll pump gas. Oh, yeah. One of the last nights you're going to see this uh, probably the way it is, huh? Yep. <laughs> so that bigger turbo comes in. What's the turbo? It's going to be a G3900 turbo. Nice. Oh, yeah. So you're gonna be shooting for nines in this car. I think he's gonna try to go 1050s to try to get to 1050s and then eventually nine second daily driver. So keep the lookout for this one.